What's up everybody? I'm outside the Super Aki and I'm going to do the second video of how much is it going to cost to buy groceries for a week. Um, the last video I wasn't very happy with. I didn't go over as many prices and get as much stuff as I wanted. So, um, so we're going to go inside and check it out and see what we can find. Alright, first things first, we're going to get some tomatoes, which are 19, uh, 1950 pesos per kilo, so that's about a dollar a kilo. Let me grab some of these. All sorts of apples, we got green apples for 70 pesos a kilo, red apples for 57, uh, 60 pesos a kilo. And then the green apples that I have at home right here are 30 pesos a kilo, which comes out to about $1.50. Not bad for a big creek bag of green apples. Definitely gonna grab some bananas. 20 pesos a kilo, so that's like a dollar. A dollar a kilo. So let's see what we got. Please. That will do. Alright, I love onions, so we are going to get some red onions for about $1.50 a kilo. We're definitely going to get some white onions for another $1.50 a kilo. Good. That'll do it. Now, I already have potatoes at home, but for some small white potatoes, probably about a dollar sixty a kilo so it's pretty good and other than that you got all sorts of fruits I have carrots at home but I'll probably grab another one but carrots are about 27 pesos so a dollar twenty something like that per kilo pretty good So I also just got some jalapenos for a dollar a kilo, some avocados for two dollars a kilo, and I also got some red peppers, which by far have been the most expensive at 89 pesos uh, a kilo, so that's about uh, a little over four dollars. So um, and it looks like all the other peppers, the orange peppers are 70 pesos, so a little under four dollars. The yellow are also a little over four dollars and the green peppers are a little over two so got quite the variety here i also just got some broccoli i can't find the price on the broccoli but they have that as well i showed the eggs last time but i uh, didn't go over the prices they're anywhere from a dollar to three dollars this is the stuff that I have at home so I'm not going to get them right now but I have two of those coming out to about five bucks so 24 eggs for five bucks not bad limes so many limes and they come out to 50 cents a kilo super cheap definitely getting some chips for a dollar a bag Definitely gonna get some green lentils for a dollar fifty or a dollar. Yeah, about a dollar fifty, and some garbanzo beans, otherwise known as chickpeas, for about seventy cents. Gonna grab some salsa for a little over a dollar, and this is the salsa that America's used to. Americans. Most salsas here in Mexico come like this. They're a lot more liquidy. It's, our, it's more like a hot sauce kind of thing going on there. Um, these are all different salsas and you can see the, it's just a liquid. Still delicious though. And they also have quite the tuna selection here. And I got this at home, 
Uh, I got five of these, but at about 11 pesos a piece, comes out to a little over 50 cents or something like that. So I'll go ahead and tack on $2.50. We're gonna get some vegetable broth for about three dollars, two dollars, something like that. Comes in handy when I make my vegan stew. Paper towels for a little under a dollar a roll, a dollar a roll, under a dollar a roll, two dollars for a six pack, two dollars for three rolls. Another thing, toilet paper, four pack for dollar fifty, under a dollar, twelve pack for a little over four dollars. So pretty cheap. I got uh, four steaks for eighty pesos. And I also got this is about four bucks. And then I also got two chicken breasts for uh, about three fifty. So I also got one of those ten liter uh, things of water. I usually go through a little bit more than ten liters a week, but I don't have a price for those. But down here, the five liters are 26 pesos, so I'm going to say that's probably somewhere around 50 pesos, and uh, that comes out to um, a little under three dollars, but as you can see, this five liter is about a dollar. So, depending on the brand, you definitely have different options on what you're paying. Okay, I'm definitely going to grab a couple of these. These all look like they are, whoops, under a dollar. So, I'm going to grab a variety and have a little bit every day. I like flaming hot, so we're gonna grab one more of these. Let me grab some of this fake orange juice for a little over a dollar. It's like orange and lime and tangerine, but I'm pretty sure it's all processed and not very fresh at all. <laughs> all right, so this is everything that I got. And now we're going to go check out and we're going to see how much all this costs. And uh, next week we'll see if that lasted me a week. So let's go see how much this costs. So it all came out to 579.41. It's 579 pesos and 41 cents. We're about 28.50. So I still got some stuff at home. So I'm just going to go ahead and tack on $5. So I'd say that you can get a week's worth of groceries for one for about $32, $33 in uh, the Super Aki and Puerto Morelos. So I'm back at the house now and I've added the things that I've already had. Uh, some eggs, some tuna, the green apples. And after doing the math, this uh, comes out to about $38. And that's definitely enough food to feed me for the week. And coming from New York, $40 or less than $40 for a week of food is cheap AF. So this concludes my uh, how much does it cost to feed me for a week video in Puerto Morelos, uh, Mexico. Cost me a little under $40, so that's a win in my book. Uh, I mentioned last time that I'm going to be doing a special surprise. So for the month of February, for all new subscribers, and people that like a video and comment on a video, one of you, I'm gonna send a $100 Visa gift card. So be sure to hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more content. Um, I'm doing
doing Puerto Morello, the month of February, and maybe um, Panama, maybe Costa Rica, not sure yet for March or April. So stay tuned to find out. If you like the content, please go to my Patreon, Patreon uh, link. It's in the subscription, I mean description, and uh, subscribe. And uh, support the channel, help me explore. All right guys, take care.